वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 5.17 फॉर द बीम एंड लोडिंग शोन डिटरमाइन द मैक्सिमम नॉर्मल स्ट्रेस ड्यू टू बेंडिंग ऑन ट्रांसफर सेक्शन एट सी सो यू हैव टू कट द ट्रांसफर सेक्शन ऑफ सी दिस इज अ क्रॉस सेक्शनल एंड व्यू ऑफ दिस बीम एंड द बीम इज डब्ल्यू थ्री टेन बाई सिक्सटी द लोडिंग इज शोन ऑन द बीम दैट इज थ्री किलो न्यूटन पर मीटर फ्राम सी टू B and there is a point load of eight kilo newton at point B. The total length of the beam is the sum of one point five plus two point one. So let's start to find the our required data. So what we have been asked, we have to find the maximum normal stress on transverse section of C on transverse. section at c clear so we know that maximum stress is equal to m into c divided by i or that is equal to m divided by i divided by c where this i divided by c is equal to s and that is equal to section modulus and we will use section modulus our in our this problem okay so let's move further and uh, uh, here you know that we have uh, this beam supported at point a and c since we are we have been asked to find the um, stress in c clear so we will take uh, you we will use cb as a free body diagram use cb portion as free body diagram so if i draw the portion cb over here so let this is the cb portion this is the reaction support so force at point b which is cb so if you cut the beam at this section c so definitely there will be a shear force v and there will be a reaction moment m this is point b this is point c at point b we have a load of 8 kilo newton and from this c to b we have a uniformly distributed load and that load is 3 kilo newton per meter 3 kilo newton per meter this is the load and the distance between c to b is 2.1 meter so what we have to do we have to take the sum of all moment about point c is equal to 0 and taking the counter clockwise moment as positive in order to find this uh, moment at point c so at point c we have this moment m so i will write this is counter clockwise so m plus due to this 8 kilo newton load you can see this 8 kilo newton load and perpendicular distance is this one so 8 into perpendicular distance is 2. One meter, and that is produce uh, a clock count clockwise moment. So eight into perpendicular uh, clockwise moment. So it will be a negative one. Okay. So this will be a negative. Uh, th since this is producing clockwise moment, so it will be positive. And uh, we have due this load. distributed load which is 3 kilo newton per meter so when you multiply this 3 with the total length of the beam and that is 2.1 and it will act at the middle of the beam so the this distance will be equal to 1.5 meter 1.05 meter so we will multiply this 1.05 meter and this is also producing a clockwise moment you can see this is also producing a clockwise moment so it will be a negative one and this will be also a negative one 
because this is also producing a clockwise moment so their sum must be equal to zero so when you solve this you will get moments moment will come out to be uh, 223.415 23.415 kilo newton into meter or you can say that this moment in term of uh, newton meter it will be 23.415 into 10 raised to power 3 newton into meter now we have this value you can say we have this we do not have section modulus and it is given that given that it is w310 by 60 so for w310 by 60 we will get the section modulus value from the property table given at the end of book mechanics of material by bear and johnson so we'll move toward that book you can see the book uh, so at this end at the end you can go to appendix and pro see a uh, property of steel roll so you have to search over here 360 by 360 310 by 60 so 310 by 60 so i will show you here this is w310 by 60 and here you can see that section modulus is 844 into 10 raised to power 3 millimeter power cube so kindly note down this and we will move back so section modulus is equal to 844 into 10 raised to power 3 millimeter cubic millimeter or in term of meter it will be equal to 844 into 10 raised to power minus 6 me cubic meter now you have both m and s you can put in this uh, normal stress maximum normal stress is equal to i will write it normal stress and that is equal to mod divided by section modulus so this is 23.415 into 10 to the power 3 divided by section modulus is 844 into 10 to the power minus 6 so when you solve it you will get 27.7 into 10 to the power minus uh, into 10 to the power 6 pascal or you will get this normal stress maximum normal stress at section c or at c will be equal to 27.7 mega pascal so this is the answer of our uh, this problem 15.7 okay you can also solve it by using this formula for that you will need i and i value and c value so if you want to solve it by this then you have to go to a property table and you have to check this i and c so i will show you them so this you can see i i is 128 into 10 raised to power 6 uh, let me show you this you can see on the left side of section modulus 128 into 10 raised to power c and height of this is 302 so c will be equal to 302 over 2 and i is 128 into 10 raised to power 6 millimeter power 4 so you can put it in this formula clear and you can also get the same value of stress at section c i hope you have enjoyed this video and kindly subscribe my channel and also share it with your friends so that my channel may grow further thank you for watching